This is your tripod setup. Your tripod comes in a protective case. It's always important to keep your tripod in your case to, so that things don't happen to it. When you carry it, you should carry it with two hands, never just with one hand. You also have ropes to put onto your shoulder to keep it safe. Inside the bag is your tripod. It's very important that you are careful with the tripod because there's many pieces on here that can break. The first thing you want to do is to establish your height. How high do you want your camera to film your talent or your video? These are leg locks. The leg locks open up and it extends the leg. It is really important that when you do these leg locks that you do open the leg lock and open it and try not just to pull on the leg because that will break the leg locks here. So I'm gonna extend my, open up a leg lock, extend, rotate, lock it each time as I go along, like this. If I was by myself, I would just place it underneath my arm like this, open up the leg locks or lay it on the ground. If you have two people, one person could hold this and the other person could do all the leg locks and extend. It is important that you don't extend it all the way and have one person on each leg because then you could wear and tear on the legs and pull it apart. The legs itself even go farther so you can extend it all the way out. Open up each leg lock. Remember to close each one. And now you have it fully extended. For today's purpose, I'm gonna close it up to place it on the table. So I'm gonna open up each leg lock. Again, let me emphasize that when I'm done, I do close each one. Take your time, you don't need to do it fast. And there is your tripod. The tripod itself has a head. These are the legs. You wanna get your camera to place right here on top of your tripod. So you have a tripod quick release, which is right here. And you have your tripod plate. Tripod plate is going to get locked onto the camera here. Now typically what you wanna do is you don't wanna take this off every time. You wanna leave it on the camera itself. So what you have is you have a threaded screw and a pin you can see on the camera itself, there's a threaded screw and a pinhole. Place, connect those two up and twist it. Make sure you close this all the way down. Typically, I like to leave the tripod plate on the camera itself and put it back into our Pelican case. You don't need to take it off every time. Just leave it on there, put it away. Um, for that purpose, so for today, we want to show you how to do that. So the camera itself goes on top of the, the head of, up here. So you have your tripod plate going on to your uh, quick release. So you're gonna place it in, kind of at an angle, and it snaps in. I'll show you that again. Good, and it snaps in. And then you have an extra gold safety lock right here. So now your camera will not come off of your tripod. One thing I tell my students is, is to never do this to test it. Always just kind of go like this to test the tripod. Never let your students walk around with the camera on top of the tripod either. This could break or it could fall off and damage the camera. Cool features, features of this tripod is you have um, pan, a pan lock, so you can pan left to right. So that is right here. You can pan the camera left to right. Remember when you do any of these releases that you don't need to do it super tight, just enough, just so it doesn't go anymore. You also have a tilt right here. And you can tilt the camera up and down. One cool feature about this tripod, it's not on all tripods, but it is optional, it is on this tripod, is you can do an extra height. And you can then take these legs, and if you have those really low shots, you can actually make your tripod go super low down to the ground and get those low lane shots that if you want. 
It is important that when you do this is that you have all the legs fully closed and locked. Don't have them all the way extended when you do this type of shot. You don't want the legs to trip on people or people to step on them and break them. Bring it down. Bring down this. When you're done, you want to release the safety lock here. Take the camera off. You're done with the camera. Leave the tripod plate on and put it away. Close the legs, extend down the arm, place it into the protective bag. Close it up and your equipment is now put away. Remember when you are filming, your camera must be on the tripod to get those steady quality shots. This is your tripod setup. We are always ready to assist you and help your media program grow. At any time you need assistance or have questions, please contact through our website at secctv.org or call 916-920-1006. My name is Trevor and thanks for watching.